Hey guys, it's Talon, I'm back with another video. Today, I'll be bringing you a review on the LEGO City new road plates. Now, these road plates have gotten a lot of flack um, because, of course, they're new. But, in my opinion, I really like them. But we're going to see in this review because this is the first one that I have. Let me grab the other two that I bought. It wasn't very good. Um, but yes, I bought two more road plates because I am doing an actual, like, Lego city that I'm building now. So, uh, I need road plates for that. And this won't finish the city and, like, this won't be enough. But it'll still be enough to at least get me started. So, yeah, I'm gonna build one of these really quick. And we're gonna review it and see how much I like it. Okay, I am back with the finished product. Here we have the box again. This is set 60304, comes with 112 pieces. And here is the instruction manual. It's a little bent, but that's it. And it comes with instructions plus. So yeah, let's move into the set itself. Let's see what we got here. So this right here is all the pieces except the extra pieces. Um, and yeah, it might not look that big on camera, but it's actually a pretty decent size in person. Like, I don't know why, but I thought it would be a little smaller than this, which I'm happy that it's larger. But anyways, let's get into kind of like the features of this set. So the set by itself, you get four of these bigger plates, six of these like ramp things, um, I think you get like 10 of these regular 2x4 dark gray plates, and then 10 of these stripes. Four of these, what are they called? Speed bumps. Get a miles per hour sign. I don't know if it's miles per hour or if it's uh, like a interstate sign. I don't know for sure. And then you get a crosswalk sign. Get two stoplights, two bushes, two flowers, and two overhead lights and a crosswalk so yeah hold on and you also get like six of these one by two uh tiles and i think about eight of these one by four dark gray tiles so yeah the set itself is it doesn't have that much you can do with it other than like just the set but if you have other city sets and other stuff car on there see this car here fits perfectly fine really good so um four side cars are good on this road plate and then six stud cars let's see they're a little tight but they fit like if you're if you have like a city like i'm doing this is fine at least for me it is. I don't know how it would be for other people, but this is a minifigure on there. Another minifigure on there, just to see the size. So if you've got a minifigure around you, just look at that, put it on a table, and you'll see, you can kind of compare these two with your eyes and see how big the thing is, because it's actually a decent size. Like, here's this figure, his two stud wide legs going across this two stud wide tile. And that's, there's a lot, quite a bit of room on each side of them. So I'd say it's a pretty, pretty good value um, with the set and kind of like the size. That's a cat. Um, I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. But yeah, so you can kind of see how it looks with cars on it and, and minifigures. And I'd say it looks pretty good. There's one thing, though, I'm going to have to address about this set that I'm not happy about. And that's the extras. All you get of extras are these. Just regular extra pieces you get in any set. So this does not come with any extra tiles, any extra lines, anything like that. No extras. What you see here is what you get, including those extras in which you get those in any set. So an issue that's going to be for me is these one by four dark gray tiles because I'm including these plates in my city 
and those are going to definitely be needed, and I'm not going to have enough of those to complete kind of the road section that I'm working on. So, yeah, that's that's an issue, but other than that, I think you get enough lines, and I think you get enough uh, two by four tiles, where in my case, I might have extra, but I'm not entirely sure, because there's there's these slopes and there's the speed bumps that take the place of where one of those tiles would go. So I don't know, I'm gonna have to see when I put this into my city, but the plates, the plates themselves, like when you don't count for the pieces are really good. I would have to, these, I didn't ever have the base plates, but these I have to say are better than the base plates because I have a friend who has the base plates, I've seen them, I've seen how they are and how they work and how they look, and I just think these are way better. They work with, they don't work with the modular buildings, but they work with everything else. Every other set that's not a modular building or doesn't include a base, uh, yeah, base plate, it works with, and I'd, I would I would go for these any day. I mean, I don't, I'm sure it's not that hard to either switch the the uh, base plates from the modular buildings or um, or like raise them in some way, but I don't know. It's, it's really your preference. But to me, these I'm very satisfied with. Just the piece thing is upsetting, but other than that, this thing gets an A+. So yeah, that's my final thoughts on this set. So that's gonna be it for this review, guys. Thanks for watching. Comment down below your thoughts on this set, especially if you have it and if you are going to buy it yourself. Like the video if you like the review and subscribe to the channel for more reviews, more content. I do mostly Star Wars stuff, but I'm going to start a series on the city. So yeah, we'll see about that. And uh, yeah, thank you all for watching and I'll see you in another video.